All right, Morgan is back to talk about Borderlands, which is a new action comedy based on the hit video game series. Yes, so uh, the fans of this video game series have been waiting for a movie like this. Uh, and I had the chance to go to New York to interview Kevin Hart, who we're used to him playing the funny guy. Yeah. And he's actually playing a very serious military mm -hmm. guy in this. So this was actually really fun to see, but I couldn't get over this cast. Jack Black, Kate Blanchett. Uh, which is amazing. Jamie Lee Curtis. Uh, this cast was so incredible, and we're not used to seeing them in kind of a video game adaptation like this. It's very colorful, it's big, it's bold. Take a look. What is that smell? Pisquage gully. Ew! Put the window up! I don't want to! Roll the window up! Roll the window up. Yeah. It's Pete. It's Pete. Borderlands is a lot of fun. Thank you. And you know, you play this serious military guy, but he he knows how to use a gun. Yes. And then you've got Kate Blanchett, who's a gunslinger in this movie. So I want to know, what did training at the shooting range look like for you two? Um, you know, before we got there, I did a lot of uh, I did a lot of weapons training just yeah. to make sure I could handle the gun. But more importantly, even though you're dealing with a video game, um, and a lot of the weapons are, you know. Um, exaggerated as to what they can do and how they can do it, you still want to be able to look the part. So as a soldier, I think it's all about your approach in handling a weapon. It's all about um, the way that you draw your weapon. And when not using your weapon, the way that you go to uh, the way that you go towards it. Yeah. So I think those are my biggest things and you know, soldiers and Navy SEALs that I knew were helping me just better understand that. But I already had a good, you know, base layer of it. Yeah. And uh, when we got there on set, what I love about Kate, Kate is such a, she's such a perfectionist. So, yeah. you know, for her, it was about making sure of the same. How should I draw? Where should I look? And um, there were scenes that she and I had together where we had like a little, I, w I call it a dance, but it was more choreography, of course, and the place of our stunt and, you know, how we were being attacked, how we responded. And Kate and I rehearsed. We got in there, we practiced, we made sure we had a nice do -si do of of what we were doing, how we were doing it. And we were both adamant about it being right yeah. and, and looking good. And I think in the final, in the final product, uh, you know, she and I both look like we know our way around some weapons, which is what it's supposed to be. So you definitely very, do. very, very yeah. good to have the stunt team, uh, crew, every team, et cetera, that we had that helped us perfect those moments. I love it. Uh, it's wild to think that this was filmed back in 2021. 21, I felt like a yeah. different person back then. Yes. <laughs> I feel like the world was I, different. As I was at 45. <laughs> yes. Well, yes. Right, you just turned 45. Yes, yes. That's a, your cancer. A lot more pain. Yeah. Lot, a lot more soreness now. Oh, so the okay. schedule and how I was working out then and what I was receiving and, and how I got there, it's it's a little tougher. And I think right now I may be in a better place physically. Um I'm in, you know, I'm not as I'm not as bulky as I was, but I'm a little leaner now. Yeah. But I'm much sore. Like my body hurts. You can feel it. Yeah, you I feel can the feel difference. It. I can feel 45. You're also on a comedy tour, yes. acting my age. Yes. So I want to know at 45, what does acting your age look like? That's the beauty of the <laughs> show. That's the beauty of this tour. Acting my age is just giving an overview. Um, in the world of being comfortable with the age that you are. A lot of people go backwards when they get older. A lot of people want to embrace this concept of turning back the hand of time, where it's about embracing the wisdom and the experience of life that comes with old age. So my story and the trajectory of getting here and understanding what it means to be here, well, it's pure comedy. And I think the audience to date has been blown away um, by not just the story, the storytelling, but yeah. you know, it's it's a nonstop, it's a nonstop <laughs> revolving circle of laughter. You're July sixth, right? Yes, ma'am. I'm July eighth. July eighth. Oh, yeah. We're okay. sensitive signs. Duality. You yeah. know what's crazy? Tell me. When you when you are, I don't realize it, but other people tell me I am. But here's how I know that I'm not. Okay. I'm not because I've been desensitized because of what I do. That's so. The point. Uh, my desensitization, <laughs> is that a word that I go? I yeah, think I want to say, use that word. if I if it's not a word, I'm very close to the actual word. Okay. So in a form or frame of that, I'm not, I'm not emotional to that regard. But my wife, my wife will tell you that she'll go, I get sensitive. And I don't get sensitive. It's very much like, well, you told me to do this and you didn't do it. And now that I'm here, so her feedback is more like, 
she thinks I'm a matter of fact sensitive. And I just, <laughs> a matter of fact sensitive. Yeah, matter I like of fact. That. Like, like I'm like, hey, you asked me to be here and I'm here. And now that I'm here, you ain't talking to me. So why'd you ask me to come? Why are you being sensitive? I'm not being sensitive. It's not being sensitive. I'm telling you, you asked me to come here and I can't. And now that I'm here, you're not talking to me. You're on your phone. I've been on my phone for 20 minutes. That's 20 minutes that we could have been talking. Or that's 20 minutes I didn't have to. Be. So I'm a I matter of fact sensitive is what she calls me. I just got a window into your relationship. It is. I like it. It is. Well, that's a window on dealing with me. With you. Yes. If matter you ask of fact do, sensitive. If you ask me to do something, I'll do it. I'm conscious of my time. <laughs> I think I'm. I think this is a therapy session. <laughs> it's because I'm a cancer. You're a cancer. You're letting it all it's, out. Wait, did I just give? Yes, you did. Is this emotion that I'm yes, giving? Yes, I just kind of yeah, Jedi mind tricked you. Yeah, I think you did. Both <laughs> <laughs> cancers. What can I say? I love yeah. astrology. All right, Book of the Cans <laughs> is now playing everywhere in theaters.